Hello, I'm David Hayes, and my research topic is understanding the entrepreneurial capacity of university students. My methodology was a mixed methodology exploration of both quantitative and qualitative data. I looked at static descriptive data to understand the entrepreneurial skills, self-efficacy, and personality traits of a number of student profiles by major. I looked at 24 universities worth of data for 1,500 students. Based upon the results of the quantitative study, I then looked at a subset of the data to do a dynamic exploration of problems seen in the quantitative data, namely low skills and self-efficacy scores. The qualitative analysis was done with grounded theory, in-depth interviews with entrepreneurship students that led to a proposed framework that showed the resolution of problems and how behavior was transformed. The theoretical contributions of the study were several. One, the literature review exposed the relationships of concepts within the field of entrepreneurial skills and personality traits and the relationships with other research concepts. We looked at gaps and limitations. We proposed a framework which involved the assumption or the assertion that entrepreneurial skills, self-efficacy, and personality traits are drivers of entrepreneurial capacity, and the positioning of personality traits as the ability to look at different types of entrepreneurial opportunities based upon personality traits. We also proposed a dynamic concept called the entrepreneurial efficacy transformation concept where students, by helping others increase their standard of living and quality of life, were in turn building their own skills and self-efficacy. Finally, there are a number of managerial recommendations for improving university education. Those span from universities to instructors to parents and potential undergraduates, and they deal with including entrepreneurship because of its importance in the new economy as a core curriculum course, measuring for universities and instructors success based upon skills, self-efficacy, and capacity, and finally, the ability that students to align themselves with programs that best be, meet their needs and their ability to drive and impact their skills and their self-efficacy. Thank you.